لأنه شعار مهرجان الجونة لهالعام سينما من أجل الإنسانية والاحتفاء بالسينما الفلسطينية فكان طبيعي نشوف عرض خاص لفين الأستاذ للمخرجة فرح النابلسي ونحن قبلناها لتخبرنا أكثر عن الفيل خاصة بعد فوزه بجائزتين بمهرجان البحر الأحمر السينمائي الدولي The experience was great I mean what more could a filmmaker want than to be at a festival where the film is recognized for best actor and the, the jury award from such an esteemed uh, jury um, so alhamdulillah I'm very very happy and uh, coming here is 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 an honor in the sense that I really appreciate that there has been a, a spotlight on on Palestinian films and the Palestinian program I wish it was under better circumstances to be honest I wish everything in Palestine was was not what it is today um, but it, it is good to be here because I feel like the film really represents something bigger than all of us in many ways and uh, and it's important for the film to be seen so I'm, I'm happy to be here how do you begin to keep them on track in an environment like this? Some of them are very resilient, others are not so much. تواجد الفنانين خلال العرض الخاص ليشوفوا الفيلم ويدعموه. الفن هو رساله عظيمه، تحديدا الفن الفلسطيني والسينما الفلسطينيه قدرت توصل الرساله الفلسطينيه لكل مكان بالعالم. آه فهذا الشيء رائع. مهم جدا صناعه السينما والافلام لانه احنا تثقفنا عن العالم كله من خلال السينما، يعني في دول عمرنا ما كنا نعرف تقاليدها ولا نعرف عنها حاجه الا من خلال افلامها، والنهارده والبرنامج الاستثنائي اللي عمله مهرجان الجونه لافلام فلسطين حقيقه اعتقد انها حاجه خطوة هي اللي جابتنا صراحة هي اللي جابت كل النجوم. I mean I think the main main element of the film is about the pursuit of justice and how important justice is and that at the end of the day violence begets violence. So I hope audiences you know just go on an emotional journey and really contemplate the real life struggles um, that our characters go through and and I hope I leave them contemplating. You know the choices and the decisions the characters made and the very cruel reality in which they were forced to make them.